Hello everyone, I'm Jim and this is Warren and you're watching Talking Vintage. It's show number 45. we got a lot to cover today so we'll get right into it. Um, let's talk about decades, upcoming events at Decades. We have our six year anniversary is this Friday. It's from 5 until 7 p.m. only. It's a 1020 event which means you get 10% off all items that are regularly priced and you get 20% back in the form of decades, dollars, something like this that you can use at a future purchase, acts just like cash, but it does have an expiration on it. That's this Friday from five to seven, it's our anniversary. We've been here six full years now. Come out and celebrate us this Friday, five to seven. We also have the Santa hunt, it, it's on now. We talked about it a little bit last week. If you're running around in the shop and you find a Santa, sticker on the back of a tag that item is yours you can find two santas per day per person it's right? like a turkey thing right just like the yeah, turkey okay. hunt except santa you might find santa on top of a turkey <laughs> if the turkey was never found so that's our santa hunt that's running now coming in the shop every day now until probably i guess the end of the month or whatever i don't know if we have a closing date on the santa find your santa and that item is a gift to you from us all right, today is the 13th. I didn't say that. Today is December 13th. Today in history. Okay, let's start off with the national days. Today is, and these go together. I really like this, okay. if you think about this. National Ice Cream Day. National Cream Cheese Frosting Day. Ooh. And National Cocoa Day. I'm Ooh. sure you could come up with something. I'm sure somebody Put it has. in the comments below. I mean... You could float a ball of ice cream in your cocoa with some cream cheese frosting on the top of it. Really? I mean, you know, it, whatever you think, put it in the comments below. Let us know what you think about that. Okay. Um, as far as the rest of the history goes, nothing good happened this day. Except Taylor Swift was born today. Oh, well, really? And I know that he's a Swifty. Warren's a Swifty over here. I, he, he is a Swifty. Yeah. Yes, he yeah. is a Swifty. So... <laughs> Um, yeah, and she's coming to concert sometime yeah. soon. But anyways, oh. yeah, Warren, did you get your ticket already? I tried. Uh, couldn't I get tried. Couldn't yet. get in. Yep. So that's the only thing good that happened today in history. <sighs> All right. So moving on, um, let's talk about uh, hot in the shop. Uh, Christmas uh, slowed down a little bit, but it's still hot. It's, it's still you, hot. It's still selling. It's still hot. You can still find it. Yep. Gifts right now are hot. Yeah. Gifts of all kind. And okay, Jim, what is a gift? Well, you know, a gift is something you're going to give somebody. But I mean, everything, everything's selling. But when we talk to customers as they come up and it's a gift for somebody and they tell us, you know, sometimes we ask, sometimes they tell us this is for, you know, my brother, this is for my sister, my mom, my dad, my grandparents or whatever. But the, it's gifts. Yeah. It's, and it's across the board. They're buying everything. It doesn't you know, have to necessarily be in the box, right? No, the box, no. I mean, they're, they're, they're just buying They're buying funny stuff. Some families have traditions where they have to buy something that's yellow. And it's that, what do they call that? The, the red elephant exchange oh, or whatever yeah, it is. Yeah. Pink, pink elephant? Pink elephant or whatever. Yeah, okay. I think pink elephant is what you see when you're really drunk. Right, yeah, yeah, so, I don't yeah. know. Maybe, I don't know. Yeah. Maybe. But white, yeah, white elephant. White elephant. That's there you go. Elephant. We knew it was a colored <laughs> elephant. But so those things are hot. So uh, gifts and Christmas is it has slowed a little bit, but it's still hot. But gifts, people are coming in and they're buying gifts. And a vintage place is a great place to buy a gift. You can get something nostalgic. You can get something, you know, unique. You can get something old. Everybody likes to have a little something old. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? They do. Um, yeah. Uh, not yourself. <laughs> Everybody likes to have a little something on, so, uh, yeah. Okay, moving on, <laughs> uh, our vendor corner. Here we go. Um, yeah, you guys know what to do. If you're a vendor, you know what you do. You need to move your stuff around. You need to clean your stuff. Um, if you are, if you're in a shop and you're supposed to contribute in the form of like hours or whatever, or you just want to make your shop better, um, you know, don't don't complain about stuff, um, you know. Don't don't you know? They, we have I don't know. I'm sure it's unique with a lot of shops. Not unique with a lot of shops, but a lot of complaints. A lot of vendors want the shop to do for them. You know what I mean? And I don't want to get into specifics or whatever. But everything that you do, everything that you require as an individual, not as a benefit of the whole, just for me. Can you do this for me? 
um, you know, that's, that's multiplied to the shop by the number of vendors you have. So we have over 40 vendors here at the shop. Those special requests, you know, are just multiplied. You know, everybody thinks about themselves, but they're not thinking about the impact of the shop. If you're a vendor, make sure you're understanding the impact of the shop, that you're not just taking care of yourself. So if you want something special done for you, then it should be done for the whole group. Now weigh that request and see if it's feasible for the shop to actually do that. And understand that your request, even though it may be valid, um, everybody else might have a different request. So now you've got 40 plus requests of things to do. Even if somebody approaches and says, I want it for everybody, it's a lot. It's a lot to ask, you know. Um, shops are, yeah, this shop's been in business for over six years yeah, now. Yeah. Um, I think we know what we're doing. If it was a, a good idea, um, we probably would have already done it by now. But I'm not saying we can't change. There's always ways. We, we do these. We never used to yeah, do these. We, yeah, exactly. So just remember that. Your, your little just can you do that for me request is multiplied. And it's a, it's a lot of pressure on the shop. So make sure you're understanding um, if you're asking for something specific for you as a vendor, it's not fair. Everybody should be able to do that. So that's why your requests might. We're, we're the team. We're a team here. Yeah, it's got to be a you team. Know. You got to be a team. All right, so yeah, whatever. Uh, vendor corner done. Okay, we're moving on. Hey, you know what? We're, we're running like we're, ahead we're, of time here. A little here. bit, a little bit. Okay, joke. Here's oh, my no joke. One. Oh, yeah, he oh, liked oh, last week's. Oh, yeah, that was a cool one. How do you keep bacon from curling in the pan? <laughs> I don't have a clue. No clue. You take away their little brooms. Oh. Do you get it? Uh, yeah. You don't get it. Do you get well, it? I know what curling is. Curling, curling yeah, yeah, the Olympic know, sport right, where they push right. the little disc uh -huh. and then they I broom it. The yeah, they're brooming yeah, it. Yeah, 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 so you want to keep bacon from curling, curling in the pan, you take, take away, away little its little curling. brooms. Wow. Okay. Wow. Yeah, I know. That wow. Was, <laughs> that was, that's a stretch. <laughs> that was a stretch, but it, it, it's a good joke. I liked it. Yeah, but nobody knows the curling. Maybe well, I shouldn't have said anything. Yet. I should have just left it out there and let them figure <laughs> it out. They right. would have thought they it was the put dumbest it the joke. Comments. Yeah, they could have put it in the comment. Oh, I get it now. I get it now. Yeah. Comment anything you want to comment. We don't, yeah. we don't care. We'll ask you for comments sometimes. Yeah. Sometimes. Put in your, your very favorite Christmas gift you've ever received. Ooh. Put that in the comments. Yeah. Yeah, your, your very favorite Christmas gift you've ever received. Take some time, think about it. Stick it in the comments below. If we get if we get some good ones, heck, if we get any of them, we might share the next week's show. But yeah, so. Yeah, so, comments are few and far between. Yeah, comments are few and far between. And we, I don't even know if anybody watches this show, to be honest with you. No, I do, we do. Who's we do, watching? We, do. we, we, we don't count no, watching no, our own no, show. No, I don't watch it. I, I don't, no, I don't watch it. I, I just move on. I need a laugh. I turn it on, yeah. baby. <laughs> yeah, I know. Some people listen to it and don't watch it. And they're like, what did they say? All right, we got to get out of here. I'm Jim. This is Warren. You've been watching Talking Vintage. Happy guys. See you next See week. <laughs>